Hello, um, I'm really late with this month's injection, um, but I wanted to um, make another video with this one and um, just keep anyone interested um, updated about how things are going on HOV. Um, so I got my uh, uh, I got my uh, fourth dose. Um, the first three doses um, came from um, or were were paid for by the pharmaceutical company by the manufacturer and um, I had a really hard time getting it through my insurance after that even though um, I started working on it a couple months ahead of time, like a month and a half or two months before my fourth dose would be due. So I thought I would have plenty of time. Um, anyway, I finally got it um, a couple days ago and I've been dealing with a lot of low back pain recently and so I just hadn't taken it yet but here um, I'm opening it up and I'm gonna inject it with you tonight um, so the last few weeks have been better with the migraines um, last time I was having a lot more migraines again um, and that has changed thankfully um, it hasn't been as bad um, the la these last few weeks so um, hopefully it's working I'm just cleaning um, the um, part of my thigh where I'm going to inject myself and I always do the tops of my thighs so the migraines have been better like I said these last few weeks um, I've just been having so many low back issues um, from the same accident that caused my brain injury and made my migraine so much worse I also have a low back injury and been 13 months, a little over 13 months since the accident and I still keep um, re-injuring my low back too. So I'm really struggling with that. Um, it's just incredible pain. Uh, I haven't been able to sleep much. So anyway, uh, I'm going to get the um, needle ready here, the injection, and I've already um, uh, uh, swabbed the area, so let's just get it done. I'm really tired. And, sorry, um, there we 
go. So I'm just gonna grab, um, can't really see. I'm just gonna grab um, some skin and pinch it together and inject at a 45 degree angle. When the needle's in all the way, I press the thing. So almost done. Okay, um, so just pull it out there and done. Um, and then for some reason, um, again, the pharmacy, it's a different pharmacy. This one didn't bring me um, a sharp container either even though um, I called them ahead and told them I needed one so I'm I've been saving the needles the used needles until I uh, get uh, a sharps container um, I'm really disappointed about getting this medication so late. Um, I was taking it at the end of the month. Um, today's the 9th. Um, February was a short month, so I'm taking this maybe a week late. Um, like I said, I've had it a couple days, so I have. Um, waited a little myself but um, I thought I had a great plan to keep getting it ahead of time so I would never stress um, so hopefully in the future I'll get it on time um, I've just been battling med medical it's the state medical insurance here in California and um, fighting for every single thing I need so it's it's been really tough and then all the red tape with the referrals between the doctor's office the insurance the pharmacy it's so much ridiculous BS and it makes it really difficult for people to get um, the things they need, the benefits we're actually supposed to be, supposed to be entitled to when um, we're unable to care for ourselves, support ourselves. So it's really frustrating and stressful to constantly <clears throat> fight the system for every little thing. I'm trying to get chiropractic for my back and um, finally getting ready to start speech therapy. It's, it's been more than a year since the accident, so it's really, um, really frustrating. But the, the HOV seems to be helping. I did have a rough few weeks um, around the time of my last dose but uh, I think it's improving again and um, I'm gonna keep up with it. So thanks for watching and I hope those of you who are trying this drug or um, this uh, treatment or another like it are also um, um, successful. Thank you, bye-bye.